Hello, you wonderful Godot people. My name's Yam with Canopy Games, and I would like to teach you how to make this. This is Zooblox. It's a quick, simple little puzzle game where players try and clear as many tiles as possible by selecting groups of three or more concurrent tiles. In this course, you'll learn how to make games like this using Godot's built-in physics engine and node system. We'll be making this as simple as possible by focusing on declarative coding techniques. What does that mean? It means instead of saying here's the entire state of the game held in code, we're going to let Godot's node system and physics engine do that for us. So we won't be telling tiles when the ones beneath you have gone move down like this, we're just going to let gravity do it for us. Some of the things we're going to cover include using scene inheritance to work from a single tile template to make many individual tiles, writing a quick little file grabber script to pick scenes and files from a directory so that you can select some at random, setting up randomized play spaces with as many different types of tiles as you like, using rigid bodies and buttons to make tiles, having each tile check to see if its four neighbors are in the same type when you press them, using pin joints to make googly eyes, because googly eyes, and much more. If you're looking to make a simple match three game, or you want to learn how Godot's nodes and physics engine can simplify your game creation, why not take the Zooblox course today? 